LTR Films Production, 75 South. That's it? Okay. For that part? When you're ready. Okay. I completely understand. I'll help you live up to the promise to balance the scales. Not just because I'm assigned to be a mentor. Firmly believe in the ideals of the badge. My whole family has been a member, have been in the force for generations. And we absolutely hate people who have no respect for the badge or what it stands for. Okay, cut. I completely understand. I'll help you live up to the promise of the scales, to balance the scales. And not just because I'm assigned to be your mentor. I firmly believe of the, in the ideals of the badge. My whole family has been part of the force for generations. And I absolutely hate those who have no respect for the badge and what it stands for. Cut. Cut. I completely understand. I'll help you live up to the promise to balance the scales. Not just because I'm assigned to be your mentor. I firmly believe in the ideals of the badge. My whole family has been a part of force for generations. And I absolutely hate those who do not respect the badge or what it stands for. Cut. Perfect. <laughs> Hello, my name is Frederick Murray and I am auditioning for the role of Lucas Reed with um, LTR Films of 75 South. Definitely a personal threat. I might be able to use some I might be able to use this for some personality profiling. As far as the surveillance, I can put you in contact with a specialist assigned assigned to you by the fallout protocols, especially after that Jason Nelson business last year. Good. Hello, my name is Katie Whitis. I am auditioning for the role of Miley Cook in LRT Films production of 75 South. Reporting on the red dot killings affected me deeply. I kept finding myself wanting to do something for the victims or find a way to stop more women from becoming one. But I think what really clinched it for me was a run-in with a dirty cop, Gil Charles. I know he wasn't working alone. He was detaining me on somebody else's orders, but seeing an officer of the law abuse his power just made me see red. While my testimony was enough to get him kicked off the force, I decided to do more. I joined the academy to try and balance the skills. Roland, hello, my name is Dennis Mays, and I'm auditioning for the role of Jeremy Ray in the LRT Films production of 75 South. Jeremy Ray, reporting for the Finn newspaper. How do you find Jason Nelson? What makes this task force different and what has been done in the past? Jeremy Ray, reporting for the Fan Newspaper. How will you find Jason Nelson? What makes the task force differ from what has been done in the past? Hello, my name is Dennis Mays, and I'm auditioning for the role of Kim Brown in LRT Films production of 75 South. I completely understand how I help you live up to this promise to balance the scale and not just because I'm assigned as your mentor. Our family be believe in the ideas of the badge my whole family has been on the force for generations. And we obviously hate those who have no respect for the badge and what it stands for. I completely understand how I help you live up to that promise. To balance the scale and not just because I'm assigned as your mentor. I firmly believe in the ideas of the badge. My whole family has been on the forest for generations, and we obviously hate those who have no respect for the badge and what it stands for. Hello, so my name is Dennis Mays, and I'm auditioning for the role of the Prince Guard in LRT Films production of 75 South. That's good. Hello, my name is John. Raj, I am auditioning for the role of Benny Nip in the LRT Films production of 75 South. Close the case. It's distraction 
sorry. It is a distraction to my office to keep answering questions as to why. Small known in town of Michigan didn't know they hired a psychopath at the police detective. No one was able to detect that he killed 20 women over the course of seven years. Why he murdered his partner and how he managed to capture when cornered. You are going to have to answer those questions from now on. I'm putting you in charge of performing a special task force whose sole purpose is to track down and capture Jason Nelson. Cut. Close the case. It's a distraction to my office to keep answering questions as to why. A small note in Michigan town didn't know they had employed a psychopath, a police detective. No one was able to detect that he's killed 20 women over the course of several years. Why he murdered his partner and how he managed to escape catcher when cornered. You are going to have to answer those questions from now on. I'm putting you in charge of a formal special task force whose sole purpose it is to track down Jason Nelson. Cut. Hello, my name is John Raj. I am auditioning for the role of Peter Chase in the LRT Films production of 75 South. Great. We've been watching those fake news channels and seeing those task force propaganda shows. Any chance to get out and take out some pigs and feds? We're going to take it. You can count on us to help you in any way we can, all the way to the end. Cut. Great. We've been watching those fake news channels and seeing those task force propaganda shows. Any chance we can uh, get out to take out some pigs and feds? We're going to take it. You can count on us any way you can, all the way to the end. Hello, my name is Tanner Swinford. I'm auditioning for the role of Mark Davis in the LRT Films production of 75 South. It sure did last year. I was waiting in the car right where you told me. As soon as I saw you coming out of the woods, I popped the door, started the engine, and got you out of there. Still don't get how you got away from all those cops. And thus, the legend of the Red Dot Killer lives on. You should sell your story rights to Hollywood, man. The Jason Nelson story. Spider Wrangler of Death. Cut. It sure did last year. I was waiting with the car right where you told me. As soon as I saw you come out the woods, I popped the door and started the engine and got you out of there. Still don't get how you got away from all those cops. And thus, the legend of the Red Dot Killer lives on. You should tell your story rights to uh, Hollywood, bro. The Jason Nelson story. Spider Wrangler of Death. Cut. Hello, my name is Becky Lipka. I am auditioning for the role of Janice Thomas in LRT Films, production of 75 South. She is safe. That whole business ended a whole year ago. Jason Nelson is probably in the wilds of Canada, long gone from here. He's not going to stick around us, why would he? I'm going to get back to Dr. McNeil and make an appointment for Janet. I don't think so. I'll go and make the phone call and set the appointment. Could you please get Jill from her room? We really need to talk to her. Cut. She is safe. That's been a year ago. Jason Nelson is out in the wilds of Canada. He is not around here. Why would he even stay here? I'm going to get a hold of Dr. McNeil and make an appointment. I don't think so. I'll go make a call and get the appointment. Could you please get Jill from her room? We really need to talk to her. Cut. Hello, my name is Ken Lipka. I am auditioning for the role of Skip Thomas in the LRT Films production of 75 Seth. <clears throat> Janet, are you sure she's not just getting sick? I mean, there's always some plague or another going through the schools. The psychiatrist did say that unless Jill believes that she's really safe, that, that something bad's not going to happen to her again, she might, have it, she might have a relapse. Janet, our daughter watches the news. She's had to have seen the stories blasting law enforcement for the fact that the Red Dot Killer still hasn't been captured. That's got to be the trigger for the nightmares. Cut. Janet, are you sure she's not getting sick? I mean, there's always some plague or another going through the schools. The psychiatrist did say that unless Jill really believes that she's safe, that, that nothing bad is ever going to happen to her again, she might have a relapse. Janet, our daughter watches the news.
movies. She's had to have seen the stories about the media blasting law enforcement for the fact that the Red Dot Killer still hasn't been caught yet. I mean, that's got to be the trigger for the nightmares. So my name is Shannon Layton. I'm auditioning for the role of Lisa Reed in LR Teams, or LR Film, LRT Films production of 75 South. Um, definitely a personal threat. Uh, I might be able to use this to do some personality profiling as to the surveillance. I can put you in contact with the specialist assigned to the fallout protocols after that Jason Nelson business last year. Good. Definitely a personal threat. Uh, I might be able to use this to do some personality profiling. As to the surveillance, I can put you in contact with the specialist assigned to you by the follow-up protocols after that Jason Nelson business last year. Good. Good. Hello, my name is Shannon Layton. I am auditioning for the role of Lisa Reed in the LRT Films production of 75 South. Definitely a personal threat. I might be able to use this to do some personality profiling. As to the surveillance, I can put you in contact with specialist, the specialist assigned to you by the fallout protocols um, after that Jason Nelson business last year. Hello, my name is Shannon Layton. I am auditioning for the role of Benny Nip in the LRT Films production of 75 South. Close the case. It's a distraction to my office to keep answering questions as to why a small northern Michigan town didn't know they had an employee, a psychopath as a police detective, why no one was able to de detect he'd killed 20 women over the course of several years, why he murdered his partner, and how he managed to escape capture when cornered. You are going to have to answer those questions from now on. I'm putting you in charge of forming a special task force whose sole purpose is to track down, track down and capture Jason Nelson. Close the case. It is a distraction to my office to keep answering questions as to why a small northern Michigan town didn't know they had employed a psychopath as a police detective, why no one was able to detect he'd killed 20 women over the course of several years, why he murdered his partner, and how he managed to escape capture when cornered. You are going to have to answer those questions from now on. I'm putting you in charge of forming a special task force whose sole purpose is to track down and capture Jason Nelson. Hello, my name is Barbie Carr and I'm auditioning for the role of Katrina Jackson in LRT Films production of 75 South. I can put up concealed surveillance cameras in Peter's house and install temporary alarms on his windows and doors to notify us when someone enters the residence. I'd also want a tracker on his vehicle and an audio wire on Peter himself. Julius, I would like your help with this. Cut. I can put up concealed surveillance cameras in Peter's house and install temporary alarms on his windows and doors to notify us when someone enters the residence. I'd also want a tracker on his vehicle and an audio wire on Peter himself. Julius, I would like your help with this. Cut. Hello, my name is Jennifer Fish and I'm auditioning for the role of Haley Bolden in LRT Films production of 75 South. Mr. Jones, good to meet you. I'm Michigan State Special Duty Special Deputy Haley Bolden. This is Cat Agent Katrina Jackson of the FBI Forensics Lab. Before we get started, I would like to thank you on behalf of the Special Prosecutor Gina Moore for letting us search your property again. Our task force hopes to track down Jason Nelson before the end of the year, and we need to cover all of our angles. Okay. Mr. Jones, good to meet you. I am Michigan State Special Deputy Haley Bolden. And this is Agent Katrina Jackson of the FBI Forensics Lab. Before we get started, I would like to thank you on behalf of Special Prosecutor Gina Moore for letting us search your property again. Our task force hopes to track down Jason Nelson before the end of the year, and we need to cover all of our angles. Cut. Good. Hello, my name is Ryan Higgins. I'm auditioning for the role of Kim Brown in LRT Films production of 75 South. You just want me to go? Yes. Right. I completely understand. I'll help you live up to that promise to balance the scales, and not just because I'm assigned as your mentor. I firmly believe in the ideals of the badge. My whole family has been on the force for generations, and we absolutely hate those who have no respect for the badge and what it stands for. Cut. I completely understand. 
I'll help you live up to that promise to balance the scales, and not just because I'm assigned as your mentor. I firmly believe in the ideals of the badge. My whole family has been on the force for generations, and we absolutely hate those who have no respect for the badge and what it stands for. Hello, my name is Ryan Higgins. I'm auditioning for the role of Aaron Day in LRT Films' production of 75 South. Aaron Day reporting for the Capitol Post. Isn't it true that the special deputies were personal friends of Detective, Detective Walt Williams, who was shot and killed by Jason Nelson? Won't that fact put them at risk of seeking revenge and not justice? Okay. Aaron Day reporting for the Capitol Post. Isn't it true that the special deputies were personal friends of Detective Walt Williams, who was shot and killed by Jason Nelson? Won't that fact put them at risk of seeking revenge and not justice? Okay. Hello, my name is Ryan Higgins. I'm auditioning for the role of Stevie Chase in the LRT Films production of 75 South. It's your lucky day, old man. Jason really wants to see you. Of course, he didn't say we couldn't have a little fun first. Got it. It's your lucky day, old man. Jason really wants to see you. Of, of course, he didn't say we couldn't have a little fun first. Hello, my name is Leon Kratz. I'm auditioning for the role of uh, Scotty Bush in LRT Films' production of 75 South. Look, he's been removed. All the guys I got now know who you, they're watching, and they've had their eyes checked. There won't be any mistakes. Check the pictures if you don't believe me, which I know you don't. Roger that. But wouldn't, have, wouldn't things have been easier if we just grabbed her immediately after Nelson rabbited? This whole waiting for a year seems a very insufficient way to get revenge. Okay. Look, he's been removed. All the guys I got now, no, now know they're... <clears throat> Look, he's been removed. All the guys I got now know who they're watching, and they've had their eyes checked. There won't be any mistakes. Check the pictures if you don't believe me, which I know you don't. Roger that. But wouldn't it have things been easier if we just grabbed her immediately after Nelson rabbited? This whole waiting for a year seems a very insufficient way to get revenge. Okay. My name is Leon Kratz. I'm auditioning for the role of Thug 3 in LRT Films' production of 75 South. I'm auditioning for the role of Sheriff Red Shelton in LRT Films production of 75 South. Good afternoon, ladies. You're the special deputies who are going to process my crime scene? Kind of surprised you got here this quickly. Well, uh, we've taken the body to the morgue and the medical examiners, but put a rush on the autopsy. I should have the report in my hands in about an hour. Otherwise, the scene has not been compromised. Got it. Good afternoon, ladies. You're the special deputies who are going to be processing my crime scene. Kind of surprised you got here this quickly. Well, we've taken the body to the morgue and the medical examiners put a rush on the autopsy. I should have the report in my hands in about an hour. Otherwise, the scene has not been compromised. Hello, my name is Shannon Layton. I am auditioning for the role of uh, Dr. Ann McNeil in LRT Films production of 75 South. Jimmy, I am helping you. We've discussed your deep sense of denial many times over our sessions. But if you help these men, they might be able to help you. Cut. Jimmy, I am helping you. We've discussed your deep sense of denial many times over our sessions. But if you help these men, they might be able to help you. Cut. Cut. Hello, my name is Rebecca Scudder. I am auditioning for the role of Lisa Reed in LRT Films production of 75 South. 
definitely a personal threat. I might be able to use this to do some personality profiling. As to the surveillance, I can put you on the contact and the specialist assigned to you by the fallout protocols after that Jason Nelson business last year. Okay. Definitely a personal threat. I might be able to use this to do some personality profiling. As to the surveillance, I can put you on in contact with the specialist assigned to you by the follow-up protocols after that Jason Nelson business last year. Okay. Definitely a personal threat. I might be able to use this to do some personality profiling. As to the surveillance, I can put you in the contact with the specialist assigned to you by the follow-up protocols after that Jason Nelson business last year. Okay. Hello, my name is Rebecca Scudder. I am auditioning for the role of Anne McNeil in LRT Films production of 75 South. Jimmy, I am helping you. We've discussed your deep sense of denial many times in our sessions, but if you help these men, they might be able to actually help you. Added something. That's fine. I mean, Jimmy, I am helping you. We've dis discussed your deep sense of denial many times in our sessions. But if you help these men, they might be able to help you. Hello, my name is Victor the Cat Monson, and I'm auditioning for the role of Julius Pike in an RT Films production of 75 North. We take that south. Yeah, yeah. The updated personality profile I've created points to your house as the most likely attack, pointing of attack. The updated profile I've created points to your house as the most likely point of attack because of how Stacy Henry was killed. He didn't go to her place of work or try to grab her off the street. He laid and waited for her at her home, a place where she felt safest. Hmm. A prepared ambush fits the personality of a Green Beret and a bully. He won't go for any direct confrontation. Because he's a jive turkey! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, <that's all> right. <laughs> the updated personality profile I've created points to your house as the most likely point of attack because of um, how he killed Stacy Henry. He didn't grab her well, he didn't go to her place of work to try to get her off the streets. He laid and waited for her at her house, a place where she felt safest. A prepared ambush fits the personality both of a Green Beret and a bully. He won't go for any direct confrontation. Okay. Hello, my name's John Barton. I'm auditioning for the role of Benny Nip in LRT Film Productions of I-75 South. Close the case as a distraction to my office and to keep having to answer questions as to why one, a small northern town, didn't know they had employed a psychopath as a police detective, two, why no one was able to detect that he'd killed 20 women over the course of several years, three, why he murdered his partner, and fourth, now he's managed to escape when you had him cornered. You're going to have to answer to all these questions from now on. I'm putting you in charge of forming a special task force whose sole purpose is to track down and capture Jason Nelson. Okay. Close the case. It's a distraction to my office to have to keep answering questions as to why one, a small northern Michigan town, didn't know they had employed a psychopath as a police detective, and two, why no one was able to detect that he killed 20 women over the course of several years, three, why he murdered his partner and fourth, why he managed to escape capture when we had him cornered. You're going to have to answer these questions from now on. I'm putting you in charge of forming a special task force whose sole purpose is to track down and capture Jason Nelson. Got it. Hello, my name is John Barton. I'm auditioning for the role of James Kelsey for LRT film production of 75 South. Connie would have loved a day like today. She was so enamored of weather like this, God knows why. But she's been gone nearly eight years now, all thanks to Leo Jones. Well, you're going to get yours, Leo. Your time is coming around again. The anniversary of the day you sent my little girl to her death is coming soon. 
and you're going to get to experience it the same way I do. You know, we had to follow the fallout protocol. The agency needed to determine if Nelson was a foreign agent looking to kidnap one of our own. Thankfully, he was just a crazed small town cop. So we didn't get, didn't have to get too creative with the reports. It still took some time for the higher ups to turn their attention elsewhere though. And Leo can be very paranoid. That's mainly why he survived in the field so long. I needed to wait for him to relax his guard. Connie would have loved a day like today. She was so enamored of loving like this, God knows why. But she's been gone nearly eight years now, all thanks to Leo Jones. Well, you're going to get yours, Leo. Your time's coming around again. The anniversary of the day you sent my little girl to her death is coming up soon, and you're going to get to experience it the same way I do. You know, we had to follow fallout protocol. The agency needed to determine if Nelson was a foreign agent looking to kidnap one of our own. Thankfully, he was just a crazed small town cop. So we didn't have to get creative with the reports. It still took some time for the higher ups to turn their attention elsewhere though. And Leo can be very paranoid. That's mainly why he survived in the field so long. I needed to wait for him to relax his guard. Good afternoon ladies. You're the special deputies who are going to process my crime scene. Kind of surprised you got here so quickly. Well, we've taken the body to the morgue and the medical examiners put a rush on the autopsy. I should have the report in my hands in about an hour. Otherwise, the scene has not been compromised. Cut. Cut. Hello, my name is uh, Kevin Taylor. I'm auditioning for the role of Willard Earl in LRT Films Productions of 75 South. <clears throat> oh, God. She did. She did. What do I do? What do I do? I, 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 I gotta call Red. Red the sheriff. He, he'll know what to do. He'll know what to do. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, God. She, 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 she did. She did. What do I do? What do I do? I, 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 I gotta call Red. Red the, the sheriff. He'll know what to do. He'll know what to do. Got My name's Kenny Rogers. I'm reading for the part of Peter James, which I played in uh, 75 North. I'm doing the movie for LRT Films, and um, I'm ready to read my line. My experience is something of the mix between Vinnie's and Haley's. I was so looking in the past victims, and was likewise not convinced of Carl Dobbs' guilt. I started following other evidence, which I later learned was planted on Jason Nelson. As a result, I helped to get Jason's brother, Jimmy, arrested. Fortunately, I was able to correct the mistake and got, got him cleared on suspicion of the serial killings. I followed Jason's trail up north with Gina and managed to be present when Jason supposedly committed suicide. I didn't see him get up and run away. I was able to help with the search afterwards, but after coming up empty, I haven't looked into it, the case since. My experience is something of a mix between Vinnie's and Haley's. I was also looking in the past victims and was likewise not convinced of Carl Dobbs' guilt. I started following other evidence, which I later learned was planted by Jason Nelson. As a result, I helped to get Jason's brother, Jimmy, arrested. Fortunately, I was able to correct the mistake and get him cleared of suspicion in the serial killings. I followed Jason's trail up north with Gina and managed to be present when Jason supposedly committed suicide. I didn't see him get up and run away. I was able to help with the search afterwards, but after coming up empty, I haven't looked into the case since. Okay. My experience is something of a mix between Vinnie's and Haley's. I was also looking in the past victims and was likewise not convinced of Carl Dobbs' guilt. I started following 
The other evidence, which I later learned, was planted by Jason Nelson. As a result, I helped to get Jason's brother, Jimmy, arrested. Fortunately, I was able to correct the mistake and get him cleared of suspicion of the serial killing. I followed Jason's trail up north with Gina and managed to be present with Jason's supposedly committed suicide. I didn't see him get up and run away. I was able to help with the search afterwards, but after coming up empty, I haven't looked into the case since. Well, that one did. Okay. Hello, my name is Dan Howe. I'm auditioning for the role, role of James Kelsey in LRT Films production of 75 North. Connie would have loved a day like this. She was so enamored with weather like this. God knows why. She's been gone nearly eight years now. All thanks to Leo Jones. Well, you're going to get yours, Leo. Your time is coming around again. The anniversary of the day you sent my little girl to her death is coming up soon. And you're going to experience it the same way I do. Status report. You know we had to follow the fallout protocol. Protocol. The agency needed to determine if Nelson was a foreign agent looking to kidnap one of our own. Thankfully, he wasn't just a crazy small town cop, so we didn't have to get creative with the reports. It still took some time for the higher-ups to turn their attention elsewhere, though. And Leo can be a very paranoid. That's mainly why he survived in the field for so long. I needed, needed to wait for him to relax his guard. Cut. Connie would have loved a day like today. She was so enamored with weather like this. God knows why. She's been gone nearly eight years now, all thanks to Leo Jones. When are you going to get yours, Leo? Your time is coming around again. The anniversary of the day you sent my sweet little girl to her death is coming up soon. And you're going to get to experience it the same way I do. Status report. You know we had to follow the fallout protocol. The agency needed to determine if Nelson was a foreign agent looking to kidnap one of our own. Thankfully, he was just a crazy small town cop, so we didn't have to get creative with our reports. It still took some time for the higher ups to turn their attention elsewhere though, and Leo can be very paranoid. That's my, mainly why we survived in the field for so long. I need to wait for him to relax as a guard. Hello, my name is Tim Potter. I'm writing, reading for the part of Vinny Pisa in LRT Films' production of 75 South. I'm still not convinced that Nelson isn't aware that his list is missing. Although he may be methodical, he's still a Green Beret. That means he's adaptable. I want additional police assigned to everybody on this list, just in case he decides to shake things up. Now, with that being said, if we're going with the assumption that he's going to ambush Peter at his house, then we need to intercept that ambush. We need to have every possible entrance of that house covered. That means cameras on the inside as well as the outside. Well, I'm still not convinced that Nelson isn't aware that his list is missing. He may be methodical, but he's also a Green Beret, which means he's adaptable. So I want additional officers assigned to every person on this list, just in case he decides to shake things up. Now, with that being said, if we're going with the assumption that he's going to ambush Peter at his house, we need to be ready. We need to intercept that ambush. That means we need eyes on every possible entrance into that house. So that's cameras on the inside as well as the outside. Hello, my name is Dan and I am auditioning for the role of Brian 
last name in LRT Films production of 75 South. One moment, please. Prosecutor Moore? There is an officer, Myla Cook, here who wishes to speak to you. She says she has information of interest to the task force. All right. You can go in, officer. Got it. Okay. Right. One moment, please. Prosecutor Moore? There is an officer, Miley Cook, here who wishes to speak to you. She says she has information of interest to the task force. All right. You can go in, officer. Cut. You might have to do it again. One moment, please. Prosecutor Moore? There is an officer, Miley Cook, here who wishes to speak to you. She says she has information on interest to the task force. All right. You can go in, officer. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, my name is Dan, and I am auditioning for the role of Benny Nip in L.O.T. Films production of 75 South. Close the case. It's a distraction to my office to have to keep answering questions to why a small town Michigan town didn't know that they have employed a psychopath as a police detective. Why no one was able to detect he killed 20 women over the course of several years. Why he murdered his partner and how he managed to escape capture when cornered. You are going to have to answer those questions from now on. I'm putting you in charge of forming a special task force whose sole purpose is to track down and capture Jason Nelson. Cut. Hello, my name is Dan and I'm auditioning for the role of Jeremy Ray in L.O.T. Films production of 75 South. Jerry Murray, reporting for the Fur newspaper. How will you find Jason Nelson? What makes his task force different from what has been done in the past? Got it. Jeremy Ray, reporting for the Fur newspaper. How will you find Jason Nelson? What makes his task force different from that has been done in the past? Got it. Hello, my name is Dan, and I'm auditioning for the role of Thug One and L.O.T. <laughs> Films production of 75 South. Good. Very good. 